Hmm. It's really peaceful today. Maybe I could play some of the violin. No, I'm not really good at playing the violin. Oh, I could read a book. Yeah, I guess I'll read a book. Here's one. Hmm. What's it called again? Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Oh, I like this book. Chapter one. Well, it's Friday. You know what that means? The last day that they're ever gonna be here. Remember the plan. All right. Did, wait, did you already tell her? Yeah, I already told her. All right. Hey, uh, sunny gal. Hmm? Hey, Richard. What's up? I was hoping that uh, you would come with, you and Janice would come with me to uh, go camping. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We have to go camping. Uh, all right, I'll go. Thanks. Wait, where's Janice at? Oh, she's coming right about... Hold on, I gotta wait. Now. Hey, y'all. You guys said you're going camping? Oh my gosh, I love camping. Oh yeah, we're all going camping. We love camping, don't we? Uh, I guess. Cool. All right, hon, you stay right here with your old granddaughter. Okay. Me and my, me and my beautiful granddaughter, me and my beautiful new granddaughter and her best friend are going out. Come on, guys, let's go. So, you guys want to play, so you want to play cards or something? Uh. Here we are, kids. Oh, no, you're not the kid that I want. You're the kid that I want. There we go. Well, kids, here we are, camping. Hmm, this place seems fun. Yeah, it does. Howdy, y'all. Oh, 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 howdy. I heard that you all, I heard that you guys wanted to go camping. Of course we do. We love camping. Alrighty, y'all. You guys can do whatever you, alrighty, y'all. Just know that, be safe, alright? I'm just gonna stay right here in this truck, son. Have fun or something. Oh, uh, okay. Why was she heading in a truck? I don't know. Alrighty, kids, here we are. The campsite. The campsite. Look around. Hmm. Wow, this place is peaceful. Yeah, not only that, but we got sleeping bags and bathing suits. Uh, I don't, I don't know about these things. But bathing suits. Oh, sick! How about we go and swim right now? Swim right now? Don't you think it's a bit dangerous? Oh, come on. The more the merrier. Also, how come it's... Also, how do you know it's dangerous? I don't know. It's... Oh, my gosh. All right, come on, guys. Let's go swimming. I will never get that out of my head. <laughs> Whatever. I, l <laughs> I love swimming. Well, I guess I do, too. Come on! Unless you're too scared. Scaredy cat. Hey, I'm not a scaredy cat. Woo! The water is just fine. Yeah, you guys go ahead. I'll just be over here relaxing, chilling. Chilling, chilling. Woo! <laughs> this is so much fun. Yeah, um, I don't want to get my hair wet, though. Oh, come on now. Why don't you want to get your hair wet? Because. Oh, wait. What about if you, what happens if you get your prosthetic arm wet? My arm? Oh, my arm. Oh, don't worry. My prosthetic arm won't get hurt. It's waterproof. Oh, that's perfect. I don't want it to get, I don't want it to break. Also, I really like the prosthetic arm. Y you do? Yeah, I've never seen anybody with it. Or anybody like you with the prosthetic limb. I've just never seen, I've just never seen anything like it. Oh, uh, thank you? You're welcome. Cannonball! Nah, -uh. you splashed water all over me. <laughs> and that's the fun part of it. You get to splash water everywhere. Wee! Woo! Woo! <laughs> so funny. Whew. How about I try it? Yep. Woo! That was nice. Oh, let me try it again. Yep. Ah. How 
refreshing. And it's not too cold and not too hot. It's just right. Yeah, it's like a mix between a hot tub and a pool. Ooh, you should go to Pom Pom Peaks. Pom Pom Peaks? What's that place? Oh, it's a place in the mountains. It has a cool little spa there. I've been there once. Oh, I'm going to have to tell my family about it. I think we'd like to try something there like that. We don't really travel much because we have to take care of the animals. You don't? Yeah, I, I don't travel much. You know, animals and stuff. I have to be a bit busy with them. But I'm happy that I get to spend time with the city folk. Wait, have you never explored the city? Well, not really. We moved to the countryside because we always thought the city was kind of loud. And the countryside was just a lot more peaceful. Besides, my mama. Besides, my mama and papa grew up in the countryside and moved to the city because, uh, you know, they kind of wanted to, you know, try new things and stuff. Oh, it's getting a bit dark. I'm gonna get out of the pool. Oh, okay, you do that. Hey, why aren't you coming up? Hey, why aren't you staying here? I'm just not in the mood. Okay. Oh, there's a kayak. Maybe we could try kayaking. Oh, yeah. Come on, let's try kayaking. Uh, okay. Uh, why aren't you picking it? Pick, pick, the, pick the oar up, dude. Pick the oar up, Grandpa. Thank you. Yeah, well, this is quite nice. Wee! You guys do that. I'm just, you know, gonna read a book or something. Ooh, survival guides. Interesting. Mm. So, kid, how you been? Fine, I guess. Hmm, what is it with you? You seem kind of stressed out. I'm not stressed out, it's just... I don't... You don't like me, do you? What? Look, it's fine. I just want to grow a relationship with you. Losing your grandfather must have been hard, and I really want you to have a great... And I really wanted you to have a great time. I, I have had a great time. It's just... You're not the same as my old grandpa. Oh, don't get choked up on this stuff, hon. I can be just as cool... I can be just as cool as your granddaddy was. Uh, thanks. Oh, you're welcome. Let's go back to shore. Okay. Well, that was a nice enough trip, wasn't it? Yep. How we cook some food, huh? Who's hungry for lunch? Oh, I'm hungry for lunch. I guess I'm hungry. Cool, cause I brought some tofu, some turkey, and some bread. You wanna make sandwiches? Oh, sure. Sure. Cool. I'll cook the chicken. Who wants the chicken? I'll have the chicken, and I'll have the tofu. Okay. Anybody want some cold refreshments as well? Ooh, I'll have some... I'll have some Cyclops. I think I'd like to try this one. Okay. Gotta wait for that to redden up, you know, become a crispy... There we go, here you go. Oh, awesome, thank you so much. You're welcome. All right, just gotta wait for it to cook. Oh, uh, sorry. Oh, wait one second. I have a cool trick that I can show you. Then go back in. The bread's back. How did you do that? Magic. Alright, here's your all right, here's your sandwich. Oh uh thanks. You're welcome. Mmm, this is good. You can say that again. Mmm, how'd you do that? Oh, uh, it was something called cooking. You might want to try it out soon. Anyways, let me just get that bathing suit out. I wonder why they made the trash can stumps. Yeah, like, isn't that all- isn't that bad for the environment? Well, sorta. But I mean, hey, they're trying to put out a good message. And that message is... Yeah, you're right. 
how about you guys go explore? I'll set up I'll set up the campfire for later. It is getting a bit late. Okay. Hmm. Look, there's a map. Oh, cool. Bah! Oh, it's a horsey. Hi, little horsey. Oh, it's licking me. <laughs> oh, cute. <gasps> it's a rabbit. Oh, it reminds me of the rabbit of my grandparents' house. Oh, it's so cute. <sighs> Seems kind of tired, though. I think we should leave it alone. Yeah, I think we should. It's over here. Oh, it's the water stream that we that we found out. Isn't it just amazing? I guess. Oh, and look at that. You're on a rock. Mm -hmm. I have the high ground, Anakin. <laughs> Let's go back. Yeah. So kids, how was exploring? It was fun. We saw this really cool log and I even made a Star Wars reference. Oh, Star Wars, that's a really nice movie. All right, guys, got the campfire running up. Oh, cool, thanks. You're welcome. Now I'll just place the mats down for when we go to sleep tonight. But now, how do you guys go ahead and for now, how about we go and, um, hmm. How about we read this, uh, survival log over here? Oh, I already read it. I know a lot of the survival chicks already because I learned them in school. Oh, okay then. Ah, roasting marshmallows by a nice little campfire. So nostalgic. Ah, and roasting kebabs as well. I guess roasted marshmallows is nice enough. Kebab thing? Eh, not my type. Yeah, I can see. Yeah, I can. I get that. Ah. Ah. That was nice. Oh wait. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh. All right. There we go. Man, the stars look beautiful tonight. I know, right? Alright, everybody, let's get into our sleeping bags. Okay. <sighs> Good night, guys. Good night. Good night. <sighs> A few hours later, probably like 3 a.m. or something. I can't sleep. Well, I could, but like I had a nightmare and stuff. Gosh, a nightmare was scary. I'm just gonna go ahead and take a midnight dive. I mean, come on now, it's not that late, is it? Mm -hmm. Hold on a second. What are you doing? It's like 3 a.m. at night. I couldn't sleep. Ugh, whatever. Are you taking a dive? Yeah. You want to swim with me? Sure. Ah, this is nice. that it was like a chime hey look i've never noticed these three little lily pads oh yeah i can see them three little lily pads and they all have shapes in them and look there's some animals there's a squirrel and a bird maybe if we, maybe if we put those animals on there it'll reveal a secret here i'll get the here, I'll get the squirrel. And you get the bird. Alright. Here, buddy, buddy. Aw, you guys are cute. Back go down there. Oh, it's doing something. Sorry, dude. You gotta put you in water. You don't seem like you mind. <gasps> Look! It's a crystal. Hold on, I need to get the lantern. Yeah, 
you're right. It is a... Yeah, look at that. It is a crystal. Hmm. What happens if we just touch it? I don't think it's safe for us to touch it. Come on. Why don't we try it out? Okay. Whoa! <gasps> oh my god. Hello there. You've done it. You've unlocked us. Whoa. What in the world? You've done it. You've unlocked us. You've mysticalized the forest. I- Oh my gosh. Th that's amazing. That's, that's absolutely incredible. Should we wake up our grandpa? No. You two have discovered it. You two should keep this a secret. Why? We don't want this to get into the wrong hands. I'm sorry. I'm so confused. Who are you guys? We are the mistresses of this, cr of this here crystal. It has been here since the- since the world has been born. We are here to tell you that you have three wishes. Whoa, 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 Three wishes? I don't want three wishes. Yeah, me neither. I think I'm good. I don't really want any three wishes. You sure? What about your grandfather? I... You don't want him back? You don't want to get your arm back? You don't want that all to happen? Come on, think. You don't want to make a wish that can change your life forever? Uh, come on, you can make a wish. What wish do you want? I don't want a wish. You don't? No. I now understand that even though my grandfather is, you know, gone... I can now I can cherish those moments that I had with him ever since I was a little baby. And now that I'm almost a teen that I'm a teenager, I don't know, fourteen, fifteen, and my grand and my new grandfather is over there, I can cherish those moments that I had with my grandfather. So no, I don't want to accept your wish. Oh, that's surprising. Usually people would take that wish and do it for their own selfish desire. But you on the other hand Decided to not do anything with your wish. We are proud of you. You are one of the men. You are one of the so-so people who have not made a wish, and we are thankful for that. Now, you must go to bed now, for you have cherished your wish, and in the morning light, you will see beauty and greatness in the world. Good night. <coughs> That was the strangest encounter I've ever had. Yeah, me too. Did those guys seriously teach me a life lesson? That was so cool, though. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. Hey, what are you guys doing? Uh, nothing. Get back in bed. Oh, uh, sorry. What were you guys even doing anyways? Uh, nothing much. We were just, you know, swimming and stuff. Yeah, well, you guys made a big commotion. Get back in your sleeping bags. Okay. Alright, good. Alright, this is mine. Visuals. Oh, wait, no, we switched. <laughs> good night, Grandpa. Good. Grandpa? Good night. Oh. <sighs> hmm. Psst. Hey guys. Hmm. It's time to get up. Huh? What? Oh, we should go home now. I gotta take care of the- f Oh, wait, I gotta go home. I gotta take care of the farm and stuff. Mm. See you guys, uh... Well, uh... When are you going? Oh, I think I might leave today. Today? 
Yeah, today's Saturday. I have to be at home. I have to go home now. Well, actually, I have to go home on Sunday. Oh, uh, sorry about that. It was nice hanging out with you again. Nice hanging out with you. Um, do you have a phone? Mm, no, but I'm wishing to- But I do- Well, I mean, I do have a land, a phone, but it's like a landline. Here's my phone number. Wrote it down on a piece of paper last night. Oh, uh, thank you. You're welcome. Call me up any day. See ya. See ya. Oh, but I think it's time to head back home. You said it. Come on, Grandpa. Grandpa. Grandpa, you coming or what? Sorry, sorry. Hey guys! Oh, uh, hey. Come on, come on! Hey, you wanna play Slime Wars? Oh, you bet. <laughs> We're gonna play Slime Poop Wars. Yay! <laughs> so, how was the camping trip? She called me Grandpa. I'm sorry, she what? Violet called me Grandpa. Oh, I'm so proud. I can't believe it. This is the first time that she's ever called me Grandpa. I, I've never, I've never felt so happy in my life. I'm so happy that your grandchildren love me. I'm so happy too, Bo. Ah.